Hello everyone, my name is Megan, and welcome to a fragment of her- Oh my god, I tried- I recorded this, okay, I recorded this for 19 minutes, and I- after the end of it, I just realized that I had not recorded my mic. So guess what I'm doing? I'm starting over right now. Um, but that's okay. Um, well, before we get into uh, the game, I should tell you a little bit about it. Um, it's from this uh, maker called Cronarion Entertainment. I got it on Game Jolt. And it has a really great review. It um, was made for a contest. I don't remember exactly what contest it is, but it placed fourth out of the 23 submissions for this contest. And that something tells me that this is a very good game. So, alright, um, and what this game is kind of about is that we're following this girl named Selena. She applied to a very nice art school and she's just living her life and trying to be the best she can be. Alrighty, <coughs> let's start. Uh, finally here. Faculty of Fine Arts, led by the famous Albert S. Seligman. I can't wait to be learning from him, a true master. Alrighty, let's talk to the secretary. Yes, I'm here for the interview. I'm here to apply for admission to Dr. Seligman's class. I told you people, sit over there and wait until he'll see you. <laughs> oh, what a bitch. Alright, silent student, nervous student. He seems rather agitated. I should leave him be. She seems lost in thought. I shouldn't bother her. Uh, Lippities. Uh, it reads, Beauty Between by Albert S. Seligman. I wonder between what? Painting of lips. Exactly, <laughs> suggestive painting. The technique is impressive. I don't agree with the motif, though. Huh. Alright. <laughs> Sorry, I was looking at the painting myself. Ooh. Boss ass bitch. You are not allowed in there. <laughs> okay, sorry. Whoopsie daisies. Hmm, guess I'll have to wait my turn. Grumble wobble. <laughs> I hope all of you appreciate me taking my precious time. I was asked to inform you that what follows now will not be pleasant for you. Let's get this over with. You're painting? Is that. A dog? What's this supposed to be doing? This is terrible. Get out of my sight. <laughs> the painting, please. No, no, no. My goodness, this is a mess. There's even color dripping from it. How dare you show up with a piece like this? You're painting. Hmm, this is not as bad. Hmm, hmm. But ultimately not good enough. But look at the strokes. My line work is far better than yours. Okay, when I recorded it last time, I chose this one. So for the sake of, I guess, staying on the same path, because this is still my first time playing it, we're gonna choose this one again. My line work is far better than the others. Oh? Your lines, you say? Hmm, you're right. These curves are rather appealing. But the rest is still garbage. But surely you can help elevate my art, so teach me. I, I chose this one, so let's go with this. But surely you can help me elevate my art. If anyone could do it, it's me. But will you live up to your claims? Only one way to find out. <laughs> Only one way to find out. Fine then. Class starts tomorrow noon at the university library. If you don't show up, you'll be out. Excuse me. I am a disgusting person. I'm a lady, I swear. <sighs> okay, we're finally complete. We have amongst us a new colleague. 
However, I however decided not to waste time with introductions. Since all your names will most likely never be associated with art, I will however recite to some again, to others for the first time, my mode. This is my class. For now, we're going to meet here in the University Library. This is of course temporary until the Seligman Gallery is finished. Why a gallery? I will teach you, and I will teach you in a real environment. This class will show you a practical approach to art. You will learn to consider the viewer when doing your work. Each week, we will gather here and I will review your book. Each week, your work will be better than the previous week. This is my only rule. If you fail it, you will fail this class. That's it. See you in a week. Mother fucking fuckhead. Alright. <laughs> I'm mature. Alright. Wow, this is going to be harder than I expected. I need to improve my painting skills and fast. But how can I get better that fast? Maybe some books might help me get started. Alright. And the only way to find out is to not talk to these people because he's a douchebag and the rest are douchebags because they don't talk to me. We need to talk to this chick who's reading these books. She's currently reading one right now behind my back. See? Look at it. Hey, would you mind if I asked you some questions? Oh, hey. No, not at all. I'm Selena. I'm Selena. Oh, hi, Tomoko. It's Japanese. I wasn't going to- it's okay. People are always a bit confused to see me. At least at first. Pleasure to meet you. Likewise, Selena. What do you think of Seligman? What do you think of Seligman? Seligman. Um, let's put it this way. I'm very, very happy not to be one of his classes. He does seem a bit strict. Oh no, that's not the problem, it's just Seligman. People are saying you've got to be careful around him. Why is that? Oh, um, never mind. I'm sure it'll be alright. Just be careful, okay? <sighs> what do you do here? Oh, actually, this used to be a library. But since visual arts are in vogue at the moment, they occupied it with his paintings and his class. And I'm a student of literature and undiscovered screenwriter genius. At least that's what I tell people. <laughs> All right. Can you help me with some books? It's my first day here and I really need to get better in terms of painting. And I was wondering, oh sure, my last roommate was in Seligman's class. She was always carrying these two books. She said she couldn't make it without them. Actually, she didn't make it through this class. But these are probably the books you'd want to be looking for. If only I recall their names. You should be able to find them around here somewhere though. Great, I'll have a look around, thanks. Sure, anytime. Alright, various topics. Write on books across all genres. There are two books in here that could be useful. De Design Foundations and Harmony 101. Maybe these are the books Tomoko mentioned. The Philosophy section. There is one book in here that could be useful. The Platom. Books on Anatomy. There is one book in here that could be useful. Forgotten Triceps. Maybe it's one of the books Tomoko mentioned. Bloop, bloop, bloop. I think I should stick with Tomoko. Oh, I accidentally clicked on the group. Uh, color theory. Here we are. Hmm, the color theory section. This one sounds good. <laughs> Green and blue is blue. <laughs> Maybe it's one of the books Tomoko mentioned. Oh, I need to stop saying that. It's going to be repeating. Biographies. Ah, oh, this one could be interesting. Ven Venderful Vogue. Seems weird, but it's one of the books. Tomoko. Book on R3. I doubt I'll need them. There's one book in here that'll be useful. Mass dot line. Alright, anything else? Nope, we're good. Hey, would you mind if I asked you some questions? Oh, hey. No, not at all. I've been studying literature. Uh, yeah, let's continue learning more about Tomoko before we dive into the books. How long have you been studying literature? I'm in my eighth semester. Actually, I'm preparing for final exams in the summer. Even if it looks like I'm just hanging around here. Alright. About the books you were mentioning. Yes. Mass dot line. I don't know. One sounds familiar. Harmony 101. I don't think so. Friend of Vogue. I, oh girl, I think I've heard of that one before. Design Foundations. 
Sorry, it doesn't ring a bell. Forgotten triceps. Never heard of that one. Green and blue is blue. Are you really sure that that, that is an art related book? It most definitely not that not that one. <sighs> the platoon? Let me think. She might have had that one. Hmm. There are no useful books left in the bookshelves. I'm still not sure which ones the ruined books are the good ones. Could you describe what's on the covers of those books? Yeah, sure. A red patterned cover? Was the book in a red pattern like a blood drops? Um, I don't think so. That one sounds creepy. Covered was the book covered in metallic fragments of various colors. No, if I had ever seen a book like that, I think I remember. Plain white cover with a single black lettered line. Yes, that's one of them. I recognize that anywhere. My roommate kept it all or kept it around all the time. Even when we went out to dinner, there'd be one of the books. Anyway, so yeah, that's one of them. But what's with the second one? Mm, I don't know. Maybe it's Lent? That could be. There were a couple of empty book slots. Maybe. But I think I'm happy with this one for now. Okay. Da -da -da -da. Ellipses. That is it. The book that will make me a better artist? Well, you've got to read it first. Oh, huh. But thank you so much for your help. I'm going straight home and get started. My pleasure. Good luck with that professor in your art career. If you ever need anything, you're probably going to find me right here. It's the best spot on campus. Great. Bye. Bye. Got it. All right. Let's... Let's make our own destiny! I should go back and start working on my painting. Let's do this! <laughs> I'm dancing right now. You can't tell. <laughs> Alright. Oh, very messy house. Very, very messy. I don't know why I'm continuing on with how messy it is. But... I know you guys want me to click on these, but we don't have time right now. We have to improve, uh, <laughs> I already forgot his name, oh my god. That, uh, dick art teacher that will probably ruin our lives if we don't start this now. So, let's get to creating. The compositional application of the three primary areas as basis for construction. Interesting. I've been using some of the principles mentioned in that book, but a lot of it is new and revelatory. Some things would have never occurred to me. Wow. This piece is really taking shape. Even at this early stage, it far surpasses my previous works. I never really thought about it was a painting. It's real it's weird really. I've been painting all my life and I never once wondered why. Maybe it's that I feel a weird sense of control over my nightmares, my visions. When I'm painting, I'm controlling them, not the other way around. So from what you just said here, I think that it implies that she might have a, a men mental illness, and I think specifically uh, schizophrenia. Then again, it's really early in the game and I have I am not so sure. So let's not draw to conclusions, shall we? I think that's a wrap. I'm happy with it. Let's see what Professor Seligman has to say to that. All right, Seligman, I will remember that in, I will remember that. Okay, I should probably write it down so I don't forget again. Excuse me while I actually write this down. I, I do not want to mess it up. Alrighty, Seligman. Let's give you what we got. Phew, just in time for the review. Ah, oh, finally. Latest addition to your illustrious circle, to our uh, illustrious circle, <laughs> has decided to show up very well. At least we know where to start. Let us see your painting, miss. Okay. This is dark. And all the bodies look so twisted in. Agony, pleasure, or fear? Okay. Um, I chose last time agony. So let's let's continue with that. Agony, agony. Precisely, it goes under one's skin. 
Who would ever want to see that? This had so much potential, but... It makes me uncomfortable to even look at it. I told you, consider the viewer. I expect you to do better next week. Now, who's next? What a dick. Hey, Selena, are you alright? That must have been pretty devastating back there. But you're still in. That's a good thing, right? I guess so. For the record, it's not my opinion. What? That art should please the viewer. I don't agree with that. Art, like literature, should challenge the viewer. What do you think? Uh, it should be challenging. I agree with you. Art should be challenging. It should be a window beyond convention. Beyond what we know. Beyond what we like. Beyond who we think we are. Exactly. But maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm so blinded by my ways of painting that I'm not able to learn. I will never get good at this. Hey, 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 now, calm down. Think about this for a minute. What's really your problem at this point? Seligman, I'm not good enough. There's not enough time. Motherfucking Seligman, cause fuck that guy. Seligman. Exactly. Him not liking it doesn't mean your work is bad. But it means you'll have to show him something he likes. He's so self-centered, it should be easy. Maybe you could study his own works more closely. That's a good idea, but I doubt they'll let me in here with an easel. Also, the opening hours are terrible at night. Maybe if you took photos. But cameras are so expensive. Hmm, that shouldn't be an issue. I got enough money left on my bank account. Just have to pop in at home for a moment to get the passcode for the account. Whoopsie doodles. I can get me that camera. Oh, really? Then what are you waiting for? You're right. Bye. Bye. Alrighty. To the home we go. So here I am. Now I just need to go fetch the code when I go to the bank. Although, where did I put the piece of paper with the code? Is it still the moving boxes or have I already taken it out? I really need to tidy up some time. We will do that in the next episode. I am so excited to continue playing this. This is where I left off before I realized that the mic wasn't recording the first time. So I have no idea what's going to happen beyond this point. Um, but I am very excited to continue this. I hope you guys are excited to continue this as well. And let's just see what happens. Alright, I can't wait to play this again with you guys. Alright, have a good one. Bye!